We will take a closer look at the credits section. What is the credits section in the first place? Credits contain the names and functions of the involved staff and companies of the game production. It is not just an honorable task to name certain involved people. Sometimes it is necessary to name companies because of licensing contracts. Let us open the credits section with the toolkit toolbar. As you can see we have already prepared our credits for this game. Within the general options we will be able to choose a music title which will be played during the credits. We are also able to choose a certain background picture. Credits will scroll from the very bottom of the screen to the top. With the scroll speed attribute you can decide how fast the scrolling factor will be. Our players will be able to call the credits within the main menu. Therefore it is possible to offer just a light version of the credits. Later I will tell you more about this optional functionality. What about captions? Mostly captions explain an area or a job. Every caption can contain as many members as needed. Within the game every member object will be shown right below its own caption. We can also change the font style, color or activate a shadow effect for captions and members. it is possible to add pictures into our credits and decide about how long they will stay on the screen. If our credits contain pictures, they will be shown next to the scrolling captions and members. Here I will explain the light version for main menu option within the general options. It could be possible that the pictures of the credits will spoiler the game or its story. Especially for this case we are able to show a light version of the credits within the main menu, which will not show the containing pictures. More than that it is possible to use the event management and call the full version of the credits at a certain point in the game.